don't even think about looking at girls, turned into, where the fuck are my grandchildren? <laughs> when I entered college. <laughs> While my very Chinese parents never outwardly expressed those phrases exactly, they definitely developed a sudden vehement desire for me to impregnate the first willing female that I meet. <laughs> Is this why China is so massively overpopulated? <laughs> I think this is why China is so massively overpopulated. <laughs> My parents are under the impression that the family name needs to continue. Though I know the surname, Dog, <laughs> will only die when the earth is swallowed by the sun. Two <laughs> things that are equally unlikely to ever happen. <laughs> well, unfortunately for them, I actually have no intention of ever settling down at all, ever. If I've gained anything from my parents other than a phallic surrogate, it doesn't reversion to most modes of physical touch. Obviously, it's not a problem for almost everyone else in college. I've been hugged at Duke more times than I've been touched by my parents in my entire life. <laughs> Yet, the act of the hug will always remain awkward when practice on I mean, really, where are you supposed to put your arms, your chest, your hips? <laughs> if we were naked, it would be foreplay. <laughs> Just think about how close your genitals get during the hug. <laughs> has a very touchy-feely student body. There are a lot of sexy people out there having the sexy sex. <laughs> I know this because the walls are old. <laughs> Who has no business even being in the same room together. 
but who try to make it work regardless. <clears throat> and I wish I could tell you all this to your faces, but you don't always get what I'm trying to say. And I get that. I really do. In the end, despite the lack of physical contact, part of you rubbed off on me anyway. Because I can recognize Chinese celebrities. <laughs> I do put my dishes in the dishwasher sometimes. <laughs> I eat at Grace's. And the lady behind the counter tells me she can hear your regional accent in my Chinese. I don't need a hug to be touched by someone. Because while actions speak louder than words, I prefer the words. My parents don't touch. And I've never seen them kiss. But I know that they love each other because they were each other's first dates. My parents don't touch me. And I don't touch them. But I know that they love me because I've never had to worry about my next meal or the state of my clothes or unpaved roads. And because even though they never speak the words, everything they say ends with, I love you. So, maybe you see me. I'm the one hugging the wall at social events, <laughs> or hugging a book to my chest on the way to class, or talking to someone just out of arm's reach. 